Hello everyone, today I'm working on building some raised beds for our garden. I just picked up a load of lumber, got some 2 by 10s and right now I'm just going to treat them with some of this tall earth natural treatment. It's very safe for your foods, instead of using paint or stain that could leached into the soil, that's where we're going to be growing our vegetables and we don't want to be eating that. So it's just this powder that you pour into a bucket and mix with water and it just goes on really easy. So let's get to it. Let's go quick. Got those all done. That took less than an hour, so not bad. You don't have to be too careful with it. Just slop it on. It's like putting on water, so it's kind of hard to tell sometimes where you've been, but as you can see, it just starts turning kind of gray, and that'll help protect it and make these last a little bit longer. Well, got this all all ready to go, so about ready to start cutting these up. I'm gonna be making two 12-foot beds by four feet, and then six little squares that are two by two. All I need is a tape measure and pencil and saw, and these will go real quick. Everything's cut up. I'm gonna start drilling all the holes to put the screws in. But since I have a big jig here, I figure I might as well use that. Takes these screws here. They're coated so they're good for the weather and won't rust out so fast. And it makes a really nice joint. The holes is all done now. Now it's time for the fun part. Let's put these together. Well, got the six little boxes built and tomorrow I'll build the bigger ones in place because I don't want to have to move those and it's getting kind of late today, but they turned out pretty good. So we're going to be really nice. All right, today I am moving the raised garden beds over into their spot. They're over there right now. Still got to put the big ones together, but they're going to go right over here. You need to move some of this mulch and get them going. So as you can see, we got the raised beds put in place where we want them. Two big ones over here, and all of our small ones are in line here, far enough apart. We're gonna be putting squash in those ones. We had all these tarps covering them for a while, so it can kill any weeds. Took quite a bit of material to fill these. We used a blend of uh, composted cow manure, some of our own rabbit manure and chicken manure. We had a big pile of our own compost of wood chips and all that type of stuff and that broke down enough so we can plant in it. As you can see that's some really 
really nice soil to be planting in. It's gonna be super rich in nitrogen and all the stuff it needs. And then just have some wood chips over the top of it to help with mulch. And here's our other garden. Got some herbs coming up from last year. And a ginormous rhubarb plant. Really excited to get planting.